Now this is a yellow tang, which is a must for every reef aquarium. Every single tank I go to, there's always one in it because they're extremely easy to keep. They are a skinned fish like all other tangs, but even so, they're not that susceptible to white spot. They do get a bit of black spot every now and then, but that does tend to go away. The main thing about the yellow tangs is that they are quite territorial towards similar species. So if you've got a yellow tang settled into the aquarium, if you try and add any other tangs that are quite similar, you will find they'll act quite aggressively towards the new fish. And they'll either just harass them for several days until um, it's, it's evident that they're going to be dominant. Otherwise, they, they do have spines at the base of their caudal peduncle, which is their, it's the base of their tail. So they can inflict quite a fair bit of damage to the fish that they are harassing by whacking them with that little spine. But they will leave most other fish alone that don't look too much like them. They're very greedy, gluttonous, really grow quite well. They grow to sort of 15, 20 centimetres in most tanks over a long period of time. So they're very hardy and you regularly hear of people that have had them for 10 or even 15 years. So they're a top, really good value fish. Excellent for beginners.